This is your Royal Fidelity Business News. I'm Jiminita Swain. For the National Insurance Board doling out an additional $16 million monthly due to COVID-19, the minister responsible, Brentville Roll, says the board is not concerned about the impact to the fund. Officials are hoping the demand for the agency will inspire Bahamians to contribute in the future. Officials have processed 30,000 applications from persons seeking unemployment assistance. About $5 million has been paid out to some 12,000 applicants. Also, Cable Baham is making it easier for customers to pay their cable bills. The utility has teamed up with SunCash for customers to pay rev bills. SunCash Director Barry Malcolm says Sun Island Transfers Limited or SunCash is pleased to have concluded Included an agreement to partner with Cable Bahamas to provide services to its customers. He notes that SunCash has the largest payment network in the country. And in international business news, six warehouses in France operated by Amazon are set to close due to a court order. The order stops everything except for essential deliveries. An internal document sent to unions on Wednesday said the closures remain in effect between Thursday, April 16th, at least to April 20th. Reuters is reporting that the company will use a state partial unemployment agreement to pay the 10,000 workers at those warehouses. A group of French trade unions took the company to court. That was your Royal Fidelity Business News. I'm Jiminita Swain.